Imagine you're on a seesaw with your girlfriend. You push down with a little too much enthusiasm, and suddenly, she's launched right over the nearby city walls. While you may have lost your date, you've stumbled upon a revolutionary realization. The incredible power of leverage. You decide to put this principle to the test. You place a rock on one end of the beam and stomp on the other. But a small stone is useless against thick stone fortifications. To do real damage, you need massive boulders. The problem? You simply aren't heavy enough to launch them. You enlist a group of friends to pull down on the short end of the lever with ropes. This is the traction trebuchet. It's effective, but your crew won't stay strong forever. To solve the fatigue problem, you replace manpower with the relentless force of gravity. You mount a massive container at the short end and fill it with tons of sand and gravel. This massive counterweight provides more force than a hundred men could ever muster. To manage the immense tension, you install a mechanical winch to pull the arm back down, and a bronze latch with a metal ring to act as a hair trigger release. With one pull of the pin, a 200-pound boulder is unleashed, screaming through the sky to shatter enemy walls like they were made of glass. Congratulations, you've just engineered the king of all siege engines, the trebuchet. In an age of swords and shields, this was the ultimate engineering masterpiece a roaring beast that ensured no wall was tall enough to keep you out.